Hey everybody, welcome back. When Geeks Collide with another action figure review. This time, the McFarlane DC Multiverse Red Hood figure. Now, I'm a big fan of all things Batman. That going with Jason Todd, Red Hood. So let's quickly let this guy breathe and take a look at it. So, of course, packaging, standard DC Multiverse. On the side, Red Hood, DC New 52. Got the artwork on the back. Some of the figures. Uh, yeah. Get them open. Alright, so of course we have the stand, which I'm a big fan of these stands. It says DC on it. Got the trading card. Red Hood, New 52. Source. Deathstroke, number 15. Real name, Jason Todd. Height, 6 feet. Weight, 225 pounds. Red Hood is a name and identity that has been used by various heroes and villains over the years. The current and best known Red Hood is Jason Todd. A fierce hand-to-hand -hand com combatant and vigilante crime fighter who was once Batman's second heroic apprentice called Robin. He has a complicated relationship with both his former mentor and the original Robin, Dick Grayson. So yeah, that's the card. First of all, I, need, I haven't opened my multiverse... Uh, Red Hood from the last one of the last Mattel waves. Uh, that one didn't come with guns. This one has two guns right off the bat. Very cool. Let's take this out. And, uh, see what we get. Man, these McFarlane figures getting it done, doing the Lord's work. Todd is. Man, very, very cool. The hands are super, like, the plastic's super stiff. It's tough to get the, uh, the gun in his hand, but I'm sure once it's in, it's gonna look pretty bad at, and it does. Look at that, just, there's a pose right there. Man. That's awesome. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave it like that. Got the Red Hood version of the bat symbol. Which is very cool. Head looks cool. Be cool if it had like a removable like Jason Todd head. But uh, yeah. Hol holsters for the guns, I'm sure they fit in there fine. Ooh, it's plastic's a little stiff, but probably fits fine. Uh, great stuff, man. Like, I can't believe I slept so long on opening and getting more of these multiverse figures. The price point, for one, they're cheaper than Marvel Legends. I'm still a Marvel Legend guy, but, uh, I'm digging, I'm digging the multiverse figures. Like I said, we're only about a year in, aren't we? So. Okay, let's see if he stands in the stand. His foot in the peg. Ah, uh, yeah. Very cool. Let's get, let's give the old 360, shall we? So there we have it. The DC Multiverse by McFarlane Toys. Red Hood. New 52 figure. Now I almost got the two pack with him and Nightwing. I'm not sure if it's the same version. I don't know. I do want that Nightwing. So that remains to be seen. This figure is very awesome. 
Uh, all the multiverse figures I've opened up so far are very, very cool. Uh, and there's, I, there's still so many more. I've got a couple new ones, and I still have ones that I bought almost a year ago that I have not opened yet, which I will be opening. If I had to rate this, I'm giving this a 9.5 out of 10. It's perfect and uh, near perfect as you can get and uh, very, very cool action figure. And yeah, so guys, that's been the review. Thank you. Uh, if you're just catching this for the first time, please subscribe, like, share, comment. Let me know what you think of this figure. Let me know what you think of any of the McFarlane DC Multiverse figures. Uh, please check us out on Twitter, Instagram. We're on Facebook, facebook.com slash Collide. Check out the podcast, anchor.fm slash WGC Network. And uh, remember, we are giving away, for five the 500th subscriber, we'll be giving away a Marvel Legends Deluxe War Machine. And for 1,000 subscribers, we are going to be giving away a real scale AEW, uh, AEW Unrival official real scale ring. So please like, subscribe, share, let your friends know. And uh, yeah, guys, Steve, when Geeks Collide, as always, Geeks out.